Hi, good afternoon. How are you? We just, by the grace of God, finished the part one of the purified or the justified um, godly women. By God's grace, we had some praise and worship and I did a little speech on why we need to pray for our godly women because they need it seriously. Our women need prayers. They need prayers every day they need prayers and today we're gonna um, pray for them because god have set them free he has set them free from every bondage he has set us free from every bondage every trial every temptation we are victorious we are more than conquering in jesus name no matter what we are going through we are more than conquering in jesus name in childbearing we are more than conquer going to work making sure that things are okay in the family we are more than conquering in jesus name concerning our health our life we are more than conquering in jesus name christ has come to set us free the bible says that curse was he that was hanged on the cross and jesus christ has become our curse and so therefore sickness challenges that women go through we overcome them in the name of jesus God has set us free. And I'm going to sing this song. Then we're going to uh, start praying. We're going to pray for our women for today. We're going to pray for our justified, godly women. Pray that God will give them victory in Jesus' name. Whatever challenge you are having in your house right now, I want to pray for you that the Lord will come for you. It will come true for you in Jesus' name. It will take all the storms away. It will take all the challenges away. Because Jesus is in that boat. Jesus is in that family. And if you have not given your life to God, I want you to give your life to the Lord Jesus Christ. Because the best thing to ever do is to make sure that Jesus is in your house, is in your boat, is in your family. Jesus is working with you in your place of work as you're working. Your mind, your thought, your heart, everything. If you are writing, if you, whatever you're doing, you want to put Jesus along. Jesus into everything. Because we don't even know when the rapture will take place. Even Jesus said, I don't even know when the rapture will take place. Even when the disciples even asked him, when will be the time? When will, the, will be the time that the rapture will take place? The Lord Jesus said, I don't even know. I don't even know when the rapture will take place. And so therefore, every day in our lives, whatever we are doing, we want to make sure that our hearts are purified. Ha, sister, you want to make sure that your heart is purified. In childbearing, you want to make sure that your heart is purified. As you are seeking the face of God for fruitfulness, that your life is purified. As you are looking for your daily bread, going about looking for your daily bread, you want to make sure that your heart, that my heart in Jesus' name is purified. In the name of Jesus, that the Lord wash us with his precious blood in the name of Jesus. We need this every day of our life. Hmm. The Bible said that the devil has come to steal he has come to steal and to destroy. But God has come to give us life and more abundantly. He will give you this life. He will give us this life in Jesus' name. As we journey with him, as we walk with him, this life, the life of Christ, the godly life of Christ, God has come to give to us. He will give it to you in Jesus' name. Amen. We are going to sing this song together. Hallelujah. <clears throat> are you ready to sing? I'm sure you have the voice. I don't have the voice that much. We're going to sing together. Whether your voice is crack, <laughs> whether you, you have a beautiful voice, let's sing the song together. God just wants a willing heart. He's looking for a heart that is willing, a heart that is ready. It does not matter you have the voice. It does not matter like I normally say whether you can speak English or you don't know how to speak English. It needs your heart. It needs your heart. It just wants your heart to be open to him open your heart be free to god and accept him as your lord and savior and learn to walk with him and as you learn to walk with him he will walk with you in jesus name amen he set me free he set me free he broke the bands of prison for me i'm going to my jesus to see for glory to god he set me free yes he set me free 
He set you free, for he broke the bands of prison for us. I'm going through my Jesus to see, for glory to God. He set us free, he set us free. He set us free, he broke the bands of prison for us, and we are going through our Jesus to see, for glory to God, he set me free. Take glory, Father, take glory, Son, take glory, Holy Ghost now forevermore take glory father hallelujah take glory son hallelujah take glory holy ghost now forevermore take glory father take glory son take glory holy ghost now forevermore take glory father Take glory, Son. Take glory, Holy Ghost, now forevermore. All oh, glory, glory, glory to the Lord. All oh, glory, all oh, glory, glory, glory to the Lord. Hosanna, 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 blessed be the name of the Lord. Hosanna, 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 blessed be the name of the Lord. Hosanna, 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 blessed be the name of the Lord. Lord, Hosanna, 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 blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen, amen, blessings and glory, wisdom times given and honor, power and mind be unto the Lord forever and ever. Amen, 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 amen. Blessings and glory, glory, wisdom, thanksgiving, and honor, power and mind be unto our God forever and ever. Amen. Who is wonderful is Jesus. Who is glorious is Jesus. Won't you praise him? I will praise him. Won't you praise him now? I will praise him. Shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shout hallelujah, hallelujah. Shout hosanna, hosanna. Shout hosanna, hosanna. Sing hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Sing hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus. No turning back, no turning back. For I will follow him, for 
I will follow him. If no one follow him, I will follow him. If no one go with him, I will go with him. No turning back. No turning back. I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus now. I have decided, yes, Lord, to follow Jesus. No turning back. No turning back. You take the whole world, but give me Jesus. You take the whole world, but give me Jesus. I give all, I give all, Lord. You take the whole world, yes, yes, Lord. But give me Jesus. No turning war back, no turning back. I have decided, I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus, Lord. We have decided, hallelujah, Lord, to follow Jesus. Oh, yes, no turning back, no turning back we give all our heart we give our body we give all our soul and all that we've got we give all our heart we give all our soul yes lord no turning back no turning back oh yes i have decided i've decided to follow jesus i have decided hallelujah lord to follow jesus i have said to lord to follow jesus hallelujah no turning back no turning back immortal god invisible god immortal god how great thou art oh hallelujah immortal god is the invisible god is the mortal father how great thou art ah immortal god lebro shanda la bali kabale bro shanta la bale li kabala wa shanta la bali bro Shanta la bali kabale, lebro shanta la bala ma shanta la bale. Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. Imota go lika ba shanta la bale, bro shanta la ba. Hallelujah, lika ba shanta la bale, bro shanta la bale, kabala ba shanta la bale, bro. How great thou art, Ali bro shanta la bale kabale, lika ba la ba shanta la bale, bro shanta la bale, bro shanta. My God and my Father, this afternoon, all that we have been taught in the church, 
all the holy men of God has been teaching us in the church. Father, give us the grace, O oh God, to put them into practice in the name of Jesus. Father, help us, O oh God, Father, even to burn the candle, O oh God, in the name of Jesus. The Lord, that the light of God will shine, O oh God. Father, O oh God, in the name of Jesus. Enough, O oh God, of sitting down. Enough, O oh God, Jehovah, of being in the valley, of not standing up, O oh God. Enough, O oh God, of not working for you. Father, this day, my God and my Father, we have made up our mind, oh God. We have decided, oh God, Jehovah, to follow you all through our body, spirit, and soul in the name of Jesus. Enough, oh God, of the enemy making ridicule of our body. Enough of the enemy telling us, oh God, we cannot serve you. Enough of the enemy saying that we cannot walk with, with you. Libra shanta la ba le kaba libro shanta la ba la ba shanta la ba le. Le kaba la ba shanta la ba libro shanta la ba le kaba le. Every obstacle la shanta la ba libro shanta la ba le kaba le. Every obstacle la ba li kaba la ba shanta la ba le. Libro shanta la ba li kaba libro shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. Every obstacle la ba li kaba libro shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. Every obstacle la ba li kaba la ba shanta la ba le. Libro shanta la ba li kaba libro shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. Every obstacle la ba la ba shanta la ba libro shanta la ba li kaba le. Libro shanta la ba la ba shanta la ba li kaba libro shanta la ba. Every obstacle li kaba libro shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. La ba shanta la ba libro shanta la ba li kaba le. Every obstacle li kaba la ba shanta la ba libro shanta la ba li kaba libro shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. Every obstacle la ba la ba la ba shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. Every obstacle li kaba libro shanta la ba le. In the name of Jesus li kaba la ba shanta la ba le. Li kaba libro shanta la ba. La ba shanta la ba la ba shanta la ba le. Li kaba la ba shanta la ba libro li kaba shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. Every obstacle la ba li kaba le. Libra shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. In the name of Jesus libra shanta la ba. Li kaba la ba la ba shanta la ba libro shanta la ba. In the name of Jesus we can do all things. La kaba la ba la ba shanta la ba le. We can do all things. Libra li kaba. La ba li kaba le lebro shanta la ba li kaba la ba shanta la ba in the name of Jesus my Lord and my Father give me the grace oh God even to edify myself give us oh God the grace oh God to edify ourselves give us the grace oh God even to strengthen ourselves in the Lord take all the weaknesses away in the name of Jesus arise and shine for the light has come arise and shine oh God in the name of Jesus. Those that have been sitting in the valley, they will rise up today in the name of Jesus. Those that have been sitting in the mud, they will rise up today in the name of Jesus. Those that have been sitting in the valley, we rise, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Oh God, the children of Zion, we are the children of Zion. We rise, oh God, from the mud, oh God, from the married clay, in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we rise, oh God, from the mud, oh God, from the married clay, in the name of Jesus. And we clean up, oh God, all the dust out of our body, all the dust out of our body, all the impossibility out of our body, all the weariness out of our body, all the fears and the drought out of our body. We receive a new strength in the name of Jesus. Oh, Father, new strength to do your will in the name of Jesus. Libra shanta la balaba shanta la bale in the name of Jesus. New strength, oh God, my Father. 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 Li kabala wa shanta la bale. New strength, Holy Spirit. Father, we are submitting, oh God, unto you. We are submitting unto your power. We are submitting unto your power. As women, Lord, we submit unto your power. As women, Father, we submit unto your power. In the name of Jesus, we submit unto your will. In the name of Jesus, that we will make heaven. In the name of Jesus, that when the trumpet sound, that we will make heaven. In in the name of Jesus, no matter the challenge, no matter the, the difficulties, oh Lord Father, because we are saved, the Bible says that we are born of God. He said, Ye are born of God. In the name of Jesus, we are born of God. In the name of Jesus, we are born of God. 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 Like those ten virgins, we are among the five virgins who we are smart, who we are. Wise. He 
in the name of Jesus, help us to be smart, help us to be wise. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, even at this end time, oh God, in the name of Jesus, at this time, oh God, I bring every woman before you. I bring every woman before you. I bring every woman before you. Who we'll go through challenges? Who we'll go through pains? Oh Lord, I bring every woman before you. That Lord, that you will give them courage, oh God. You will give them courage for today and courage forever. In the name of Jesus, strengthen every woman. Oh God, Father, strengthen every woman. Strengthen every woman. Give grace to every woman. Give grace to every woman. God, that are going through challenges, going through problems. Give grace, oh God. Strengthen every woman. In the name of Jesus, let our candle, oh God, let the fire in us, oh God, burn. In the name of Jesus, a woman who has backslidden, a woman who does not know God, a woman, oh God, who is frustrated, a woman, oh God, who is looking up to you, oh God, for our daily bread, for our children, for our husband, for our marriage. Lord Jehovah, I call upon you today. In the name of Jesus, my God and my Father, we will not lose our birthright. We will not lose that glory. We will not lose the destiny that you have called us, oh God, to be. In the name of Jesus, Father, do something new in our life. Oh God, Father, prosper every woman. In the name of Jesus, spiritually, oh God, psychologically, oh God, in the name of Jesus, materially, oh God, in the name of Jesus, spiritually, oh God, that we will lack nothing. No woman will lack anything. In the name of Jesus, no woman will lack anything. Oh God, strengthen up every woman. Lift up every woman. In the name of Jesus, Father, we thank you for today. Blessed be your name. Father, we thank you. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. He is worthy to be praised and adored. And so we lift up holy hands in one accord and singing, Blessed be the name. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name hallelujah blessed be the name of the lord amen i hope you are praying with me this afternoon we are going to be praying for women and we have already started praying we want to pray that the lord will make every woman to be excellent in jesus name every woman we want god to make every woman in the name of jesus every christian mother wherever you might be we want to pray that god will help us to be excellent excellent in every field excellent in any area wherever you are serving the lord god will give you an excellent spirit in jesus name god will give you the auction to serve the grace to serve in the name of jesus god will place on you his mantle to serve in the name of jesus we are called to serve not just serve in the kitchen not just serving in the bedroom not just serving in the living room but we are called to serve the lord we are called to serve the lord Remember when the Lord was living, when he was living, he said, go ye into the world and preach the gospel and preach the word of God. Woman, are you preaching the word of God? Woman, are you doing what God has called you to do? Are you doing what God has called you to do? Or what you are called to do is just to cook. It's just to make sure that you are giving birth to children. It is far more than that. It is far more than that. I want you as a woman to start building your godly home. Start building your heavenly home. Have you started building your heavenly home? Which material are you using? What are the materials that you have started using to build your godly home? What material are you using to build your godly home? God wants us to start to build our godly home today. God will give you and high the grace of an excellent spirit in Jesus' name. We are going to look at Proverbs chapter 31. Proverbs chapter 31. Open your Bible with me and read the book of Proverbs chapter 31. And we we'll use Proverbs chapter 31 to pray. God is looking for an excellent spirit in the life of every godly woman. God wants every godly woman to have an excellent spirit. Excellent spirit. By God's grace, Mary had an excellent spirit. And that was how, why God was able to use her. He was able to use her to fulfill his promise. And I believe that in your life, in my life, for every woman... God has a promise for you. 
he has a promise for you he has a plan for you and he said my plan for you is of good and not of evil every plan that god has for a woman for every woman is of good and not of evil and by god's grace that plan will, be, will come to pass in jesus name i'm going to read he said uh who can find a virtuous woman for her price is far above rebels who can find a godly woman it says an excellent wife who can find for our world is far above jewelries our world is far above what jewelries it's not the jewelries that you wear that makes you to be a woman it's not you know the painting of the face you want to look more beautiful for your husband sometimes you might dress and look so good and yet there are some men they still don't even appreciate the woman they have they still don't love the woman that they have it's not the clothes it's not the clothes the clothes are beautiful the jewelries all those things it will not take us to heaven it will not take us to heaven an excellent spirit and what is that excellent spirit number one that excellent spirit is the salvation of your soul that is the spirit christ is looking for that excellent spirit if christ can find that you are saved that you have given your life to him that is what is looking for that is the number one thing the number one the number two thing is your sanctification have you prayed have you prayed through to sanctification have you given your life to jesus and have you prayed that oh lord come into my heart i am saved but i'm still struggling with life i'm still struggling with anger i'm still struggling with bitterness i'm still struggling in this world stealing selling life i'm still struggling i can't help myself for you to be for you to have this complete excellent spirit God wants us to uproot the Adamic nature away from our heart. Those things that will not glorify God, God wants us to take them away. And so this morning, we are going to pray for an excellent spirit. It's not just putting on of jewelries, earrings, makeup. No, all those things will not take us to heaven. He wants a righteous woman. God wants you to be righteous. He wants you to be pure. He wants you to be holy, that you should be presentable before him presentable before him that when he shall come when he will come that you will be able to stand with him stand before him because all those things that you are putting on they don't put those things in heaven there's nothing like that in heaven nothing nothing it is the glory of god it's only the glory of god that will shine in you now my question to you is do you have the glory of god in you do i have the glory of god in you that is what christ is looking for in you the, his glory, his glory, his spirit, the glory of God, the anointing of God. That is the only thing Christ is looking for. When the trumpet shall sound, is the glory is looking for. The fire is looking for. Is your heart burning for God? Are you burning for God? That when the trumpet will sound, that you will make it. I will make it. Are you searching the scripture? God wants to search. God wants us to search the scripture. I read from Proverbs chapter 31, verse 10. It says, an excellent wife, an excellent wife. And King James says, he said, who can find a virtuous woman? Who can find a virtuous woman? For our prize is far above rubies. We are going to pray for an excellent woman today. That God will make you to be an excellent woman. That I will be an excellent woman in Jesus' name. Amen. Our Father, we just want to thank you, Father, for every woman, oh God, that will be listening to me. Even those that are not listening, Father, I'm praying that this afternoon, you will give us, oh God, an excellent spirit in Jesus' name. Excellent spirit. Number one, like I've said, and that you know, an excellent spirit is a woman who has been washed with the blood of Jesus. Jesus. An excellent spirit is a woman that is saved. 
an excellent spirit is a woman, oh God, that have realized that she is a sinner and that she wants to repent. All that she repents, she gives her life to you. That is the excellent spirit you are looking for. An excellent spirit is the woman that every day by day she is doing your will in the name of Jesus and that she's making sure that her household, every one of them, they are saved. Father, that is the excellent spirit you are looking for. An excellent spirit is the one, Father, who seeks your will who wants to do the right way in the name of Jesus Christ. An excellent spirit, O oh God, is the one that has been saved and that you have deposited, O oh God, your glory upon that person. That each day, whatever the person is doing, the person checks with you. He checks his assignment with you before the person does anything. Holy Spirit, Father, we are praying for this excellence, O oh God, in our life. It is this excellent spirit, O oh God, that will take us to heaven. And Lord, today we are praying to prepare us for heaven. Every woman, oh God, this afternoon, we want to prepare every woman for heaven. I want to prepare myself for heaven. I want to prepare, oh God, myself, the coming of Christ, oh God, again to this head. In the name of Jesus. Ah, Father Lord, preparing for the rapture. In the name of Jesus. Each day watching, oh God. Yes, our leaders are going to help us. Yes, our pastors are going to help us. But we ourselves, we need to help myself as a woman oh god i need to help myself as a woman you need to help yourself ah in the name of jesus you don't want to continue to be like matter in the bible all she does was to cook and cook and forget that christ was sitting in her living room that christ was in her house holy spirit oh god help me holy spirit help every woman in the name of jesus help every mother help every sister awake awake oh Zion. Awake, O Zion. Awake, O woman. Awake, O woman. In the name of Jesus, awake from nagging. Awake from problem. Awake, oh, the house is dirty. Awake, awake. Oh, all those things. Awake. Awake, oh, there is no food. Awake, O woman. Awake, O woman. Oh, I need a better job. Awake, I want to build a house. Awake, oh God, O woman. Oh, there is no money in my account. Awake, there is money. In the name of Jesus, the Lord is providing. The Lord has provided. The Lord is meeting our needs. In the name of Jesus, the Lord is meeting our needs because he said he will supply her needs according to his riches in glory. In the name of Jesus, he will meet us even at the point of our needs. Our Father, we thank you for every woman. We bless you, Daddy, for every woman who, oh God, is looking up to you right now and who is praying along with me. In the name of Jesus, who, oh God, looking at you, oh God, has I Ebenezer, in the name of Jesus, you will meet every woman, oh God. Make us so God, give us an excellent spirit. Oh, put a fresh spirit in our heart. Oh God, help us to start with you afresh. That we will start with you afresh. That woman that is there, that woman that is there, oh God, that have stopped praying, that have stopped reading our Bible, that have stopped oh God, seeking your face, that have stopped going to the church. Oh God, that have stopped seeking your face. Oh my God and my father, because of challenges. Oh in the name of Jesus, I encourage you today to wake up. I encourage you today to stand up. I encourage you to come out of the married clay. I encourage you to be strengthened by the Lord. In the name of Jesus, I encourage you to go back to read the Bible because you have enough. There is food in the Bible. There is daily bread in the Bible. In the name of Jesus, the Lord will supply your needs. The Lord will meet you at the point of your needs. The Lord will encourage you. The Lord will strengthen you today. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every woman in the name of Jesus. Today is the day of your salvation. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The Lord bless you today. In Jesus mighty name we pray. Amen. I'm going to pray again for every woman again. I'm going to look at the book of Proverbs. The same Proverbs chapter 19. Open your Bible. I have my Bible here. Please open your Bible to the book of Proverbs chapter 19, chapter 19, verse, um, verse 14. I read, it said, House and riches are the inheritance of fathers, and a prudent wife is from the Lord. And a prudent wife is from the Lord. Let me read verse 15. Slothfulness casted into a deep sleep, 
an unhidu soul shall suffer hunger. We will not suffer hunger in Jesus' name. No woman will suffer hunger in Jesus' name. He said, houses and riches are the inheritance of fathers. And a prudent wife is from the Lord. We're going to pray that God will cause every woman to be prudent in Jesus' name. And that we will not be slothful. No woman will be slothful in Jesus' name. And that we will not be idle. In the things of the Lord, you will not be idle. Have you been sitting down? And allowing only the men to do everything, you will not be high to. Look at Deborah in the Bible. She was a mother. She was a mother, but she was able to fight with her husband. And by God's grace, God gave them victory. Look at the Bible. God gave them what? Victory. I think in the book of Judges. God gave them victory. She did not just sit down. She was not slothful. We will not be weak in Jesus. We will not be high to. Arise, O Israel. Today, I am calling every woman, wherever you are, you are the spiritual Israel. Arise, O Israel. The Lord has blessed you. You are not cursed in Jesus' name. Every curse, we destroy it. We remove it from your life in Jesus' name today. Let's pray. Every mark of evil, every mark, the Lord destroys in Jesus' name. And you will do better than yesterday in Jesus' name. Our Father, we thank you because, oh God, no woman is lawful. In the name of Jesus, no woman is lawful. Father, you are causing every woman, oh God, to be prudent. In the name of Jesus, every woman is prudent. In the name of Jesus, every woman is prudent. In the name of Jesus, no woman is idle. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord, no woman is idle. We will not be idle. We will not be slothful. We will not be weak in Jesus' name. Spirit Spiritually and physically, we will not be weak. Strengthen us, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Strengthen every woman, oh God, this afternoon. Strengthen every woman. Give, oh God, that woman the divine grace, the divine strength, oh God, in the name of Jesus. God, anoint every woman. Anoint every woman in the name of Jesus. Proverb in the name of Jesus, chapter 19 says, verse 14, houses and riches are inheritance of fathers, and a prudent wife is from the Lord. In the name of Jesus, cause every woman to be prudent, every woman to be prudent. In the name of Jesus, all that you are demanding from a woman, Father, help us so God to fulfill it in Jesus' name. Help us so God even to walk accordingly in the name of Jesus. Help us so God even to be submissive, oh God, to our husband, submissive, oh God, Jehovah, to you in the name of Jesus. Father, to you first, that we will hear from you first. We will hear from you first in the name of Jesus. That we will seek direction from you in the name of Jesus. Every woman, oh God, that is seeking for divine direction from the Lord, the Lord, that they will hear from you, God, in Jesus' name. We pray, Father, for every woman, the Lord, that they will seek direct, oh God, direction from you in the name of Jesus. In terms of childbearing, we are praying that God, that you will give every woman victory in the name of Jesus every woman victory godly seed fruitful seed for every woman in the name of jesus that no woman will suffer father we bless you we give you all the glory you are worthy to be praised oh god in jesus name we pray amen look at again proverbs chapter 18 let's go to proverbs chapter 18 proverbs chapter 18 the word of god is sweet and is sharper than any edges sword, the word of God is sharp, it will break and destroy anything that is not supposed to be in our life again in Jesus' name. As you and I choose to serve the Lord, as you and I choose to be faithful, to be obedient to Christ, God will bring everything that you have lost or that you are expecting, God will bring them to pass in Jesus' name. Just be in the right path. Just choose to serve God. Make up your mind that today I decide to serve God. I decide to serve you today. And if you decide to serve God, it does not matter what anything and anything that happens. It does not. It does not matter what happens in heaven or in hell. The Lord, the Bible says that you are in His palms. He's taking care of you in Jesus' name. You are engraved in His palm. You are engraved. You are inside His hands. And if you are in the hands of God, who is that person that can touch you? What is that thing? What is that problem? What is that challenge? God will take care of you in Jesus' name. Let's look at Proverbs chapter 18. Are you ready? Open your Bible. Proverbs chapter 18 verse uh, 22. It says, Whoso findeth a wife, findeth a good thing, and obtaineth favor of the Lord. 
Rousseau find it a wife, find it a good thing, and obtain it favor of the Lord. We are going to pray on this. Now, God will grant us favor. Every woman, God will grant you favor in Jesus' name. Favor on every side. Have you lost favor? Have I lost favor? Favor on, on every side in Jesus' name. Who he who findeth a wife, findeth a good thing, and obtaineth favor from the Lord. He who findeth a wife, findeth a good thing, and obtaineth favor from the Lord. Proverbs chapter 18, verse 22. Let's pray. Let's take that to God in prayers. Lord, we thank you, God, for every woman in Jesus' name, every married woman, whether you are married, you are not married, we are praying that, God, that you will grant every woman favor in Jesus' name. Favor, Lord. Even at this time, we are praying for favor in Jesus' name. Every young lady, God, Father, seeking the face of God for a godly husband, that, Lord, that you will make way for her in the name of jesus and all those that are married oh god every woman that lord they will find favor oh god they will find favor in the name of jesus christ they will find favor oh god we also bring the single mothers before you that they will find favor in the name of jesus we bring the widows before you that they will find favor every widow god father that they will find favor in the name of jesus father that they will find favor that you will care for them that you will be their husband in the name of jesus you told the children of israel you said i am your husband you said i am jealous of you my god and my father every widow every woman father that seek your face oh god that you will be jealous of us oh god that you protect us oh god in the name of jesus christ oh father that lord i will find favor of you in the name of jesus that we will lack nothing we will lack nothing in the name of jesus we are favored and blessed in jesus name we are the righteousness of god in christ jesus in the name of jesus we are blessed hallelujah your children are blessed in jesus name we are so so blessed oh god thank you father in jesus name we pray amen i'm gonna also again use the book of proverbs chapter 3 proverbs chapter 3 by god's grace proverbs chapter 3 to pray god just wants us to be in line with him proverbs chapter 3 opens to proverbs chapter 3 verse 15 we are praying for all our godly women verse 15 i read she is more precious than rubies and all the things thou canst desire are not to be compared unto her you see she's more precious god is telling you that you are more precious than rubies than anything than diamonds than gold anything just be natural just be yourself you don't have to go look for anything to put on anything to make yourself beautiful just be yourself you are more precious than all those things that you are seeking for you are more precious the bible says that you are more more precious so let's begin to pray when god created you he looked for a perfect face he looked for a perfect human being and when she was with adam she was so perfect and show so beautiful so beautiful so beautiful because god called her the mother of the world the first mother of the world ever the first mother of the world ever and god gave her all the qualifications that she needed at that time and by god's grace we are going back to that qualification those good things that the lord gave to us and the devil came and he snatched it away from us in the name of jesus you know that curse was he that was hanged on the cross who was hanged on the cross it was jesus he came to redeem you the lord jesus has come to redeem you because he has come to redeem you you have got all those qualifications back all those good things that the lord by the grace of god gave to our mother in those days in that time at the garden we are getting them back we have them back in jesus name especially when you have given your life to christ you have the right to take them back again in jesus name let's begin to pray let's begin to pray thank you lord jesus we thank you lord we thank you lord we thank you lord we thank you lord we thank you we bless you we give you all the glory 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 thank you jesus thank you lord thank you lord length of days is in our right hand oh god in the name of jesus and in and in her left hand riches and honor 
Thank you, Father, because we are rich. We are blessed in Jesus' name. She is a tree of life. Oh, Lord, I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. Our ways are ways of pleasantness and our paths are peace in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Thank you for the word of God says our ways are the ways of pleasantness and our paths 